Hey, welcome back to Cool Kids Art, and let's draw the funny looking tomato skin in Fortnite. So let's get started with a quick sketch, and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so to draw this, we're gonna start out with his eyes, and it's gonna be pretty much the same way that I've drawn the other one, the um, tomato, tomato Town statue. Alright, so we just gotta draw two egg shapes like this, kind of pointed inwards. And then for his eye eyeball, we're just gonna kind of fill in a little bit on the inside. And then from there, we can draw in his uh, funny looking eyebrow. So we can just come up and we can draw two lines like this first. And then go up from the middle. And then we're just gonna slant it down and meet up with the end over there. Okay? And then from here we can draw his mustache. So we can st start in the middle, we can put a little dot. And then we just kind of curve, make two little bumps like this. And now we're gonna curve it out. So, so it's gonna come down and it's gonna go up a little bit. And now for the bottom part, we can come down. We can also make a little dot, it, make it easier. And then we can just come out, slight curve and just kind of roll it back up. Okay, so we're gonna come down, just kind of roll it back up. And then after that, we're gonna draw his mouth. So um, just kind of come up here on this, the corner of his, uh, on where the mustache is. Just draw two curves like that, so it's gonna be like a little bracket. And then we're gonna curve this down right behind the, the mustache. And then now we're gonna curve this down. Just gonna be one big curve. And just meet up with that all right and then from here we can draw in his teeth so in here just draw one curve first and then we're gonna go up so that's gonna be the top row of his teeth and then we're gonna come down just go all the way down and then now we're gonna draw one more row down here all right so that's pretty much his uh, feature so now we just gotta draw the circle around his head so the easier way is um, you can also just kind of on the side here, just do two big brackets like this. Okay, and then once you have this, let's just kind of curve it because it's a little bit flatter on the top and also on the bottom. And let's give it on, on the slip here, on the lower lip, just add a little bit of line there. All right, so then we're gonna, let's move up and uh, finish up the, uh, the little leaf here. So in the middle, just kind of go up and then curve back down. And then from here, draw this. Okay, so it's gonna be folding right there. So it looks like it's being folded. Okay, so we're gonna go draw one more. We're gonna come up, just kind of go down a little bit and then we'll just push it back in like this. All right, and then for the stem, this one's easy. Just go up, just give it a little taper and close it off. All right, so that's his funny looking head. Um, so let's move down to his body and let's see. Okay, so we're gonna start here. We're gonna give him the collar here. Let's draw a little curve like this. Two lines. And then we're gonna go back up. So that's gonna be his collar. Okay, and then from here, we're gonna draw his shoulder. So we're gonna come out. Okay, not too far. And then we're gonna come down a little bit first. This is gonna be his armpit area. And then now we're gonna just kind of pinch it in. And then we're gonna close it off and this is gonna be his belt. And since we're down here, we'll just extend it. This will be one belt and then let's go one more section. All right, so that's two and we can give in, yeah, let's finish up the belt. So the little belt buckle here, real simple. And we'll give two loops. And then on the bottom, there's gonna be a smaller one. We draw two lines in there, and then let's give another two belt loops. All right, so from here, let's draw in his arm. So this arm's gonna be folded in, or we'll folded to his side. So we're gonna come out for his shoulder. And his arm here, we're gonna come up a little bit. And now I'm gonna curve and just kind of do that first. Okay, and then now we're gonna draw his hand over here first. So 
just gonna come down and just draw like a little angle like this and then this is gonna be his glove so we're gonna draw some lines just got some details and there's a little bit of detail here too so we'll just draw that so that's his fist on his waist so now we can connect it so we're gonna come up just kind of give it a curve like that okay and then for this one we're just gonna curve it until we meet up with this corner all right so it's actually easier to just draw the hand first before you draw the elbow all right so let's move on to the other arm and so this one's gonna be kind of folded upward so elbows the shoulders gonna be the same okay, and then we're gonna come out and then we're gonna close it off because we're gonna draw in it's got a little band here so just draw a little rectangle we're gonna come out just a little bit all right and then now we're gonna draw the folded arm here so we're gonna curve so we're gonna curve it like that okay then we're gonna come back down and now we're just going to close that off at an angle. So that's his elbow. And now he's got some he's got some details on his glove. And let's see, let's draw one rectangle here. And same thing, he's got some lines. And let's add in a little panel on this arm here. And now for his hands, so it's a little bit different. Um, we're going to curve up like this. And let's draw his thumb like this, kind of pointing outward. Okay, or inwards, I guess, depending on how you see it. And then we're going to come up here. That's going to be the back of the palm. And then now we're going to draw the inside of the palm here. And now we're going to draw one finger kind of folding in. So we're going to go this way. It's kind of a funny pose. I'm not sure what he's doing with his hands. Okay, so that's one finger. And we're going to draw another one. Okay. So two, and that's probably enough. And we're going to draw in, he's got a little bit of detail, like this is actually part of his glove. So we just draw some lines like that. It's because his fingers go through the glove. Alright, so now let's move on. Well, let's add in the detail on his shirt, which is kind of cool. So let's just draw in this piece of slice here. Just draw in a little rectangle. Okay, that's the piece of crust right there. And then the pepperoni is going to be easy, right? Just draw some curves. All right, so that was very simple. And now there's gonna be, it's got some lines. So we can start out with the middle one. Just draw two lines like this. And then we're gonna draw two lines like this because that's gonna be another stripe. So one more on this side. And then on here, just draw in a bigger one. A little bit fatter than the other ones. So same thing on this side. All right. Okay, so let's move on to his legs. And to draw his legs, just come down straight, draw a little line there. And then now we're gonna go out. So here, continue the curve and just kind of go out. Pinch it back in, close it. That's gonna be his, his knee right there. And then we're gonna draw the other side. So same thing, continue the curve, close it. All right, and then now let's draw in almost like a square. That's his knee. Two lines for the armor, and then we're gonna go out. And then we're gonna pinch it back in. Just give it a little curve. Close it off. And now for the dome shape on his shoes. Just have it come out more on this side. Close it off and just give it a little bit of sole and add a little bit of detail. And then let's add in this armor. And let's add in the detail here. Just a little patch. Just draw a little triangle like that. I mean a square. And then we're gonna draw in the stitchings on both sides. So that's very easy. And then we're gonna give him two straps. So that's one and two. All right, so let's finish off the other leg and just gonna draw another kind of rectangle. Two lines and then again, you can use this as a guide how far to go down. Pinch it in again. 
close it off. Now for the dome shape, down and then go out on this side a little bit more. Close it off. Little rectangle on the bottom and just two more to give us some detail. Okay. And for the strap, we're gonna go this way. And one more this way. And then now we're just gonna finish off, just kind of continue those two lines all the way down. And that is it for this tomato skin in Fortnite. It's uh, definitely a very funny looking character and skin. So hope you guys like the way it turned out. And if you do, please do give me a thumbs up and I will see you next time.